it's Shannon, and today I'm going to be doing a short haul. It's just two items, but one of the items I'm going to be kind of doing a first impression of. Um, so the first thing I have is some new shampoo. This is the Pantene Pro-V Beautiful Lengths um, Strengthening Shampoo. And I think this is for some kind of cancer. I'm trying to read on it. It doesn't say anything specific, but it has the little ribbon right here for cancer. And it's pink and purple, so I'm guessing it's breast cancer, but I'm not exactly sure. And it says, 500,000 ponytails donated and counting. So, I'm really excited to use this. It looks really cool. It smells really nice. It smells kind of like strawberries or like some kind of berries. But the bottle is really cute, and I really like what it's for and everything, so there's that. And the next thing I have, which is what I'm going to be doing a review on, I have only opened this, like opened the box itself. I haven't, like, looked inside or anything. But this is the Wet n Wild Los Angeles T Center Stage Collection, and this is the limited, edis limited edition Jet Set Makeup Palette, and it has 180 shades for eyes, lips, and face. And it's a $200 value for $30. And I got this because I had a gift card for $5 off um, that expired today. So I went and got it because I was really wanting it. And it says it has 90 eyeshadows, 45 lip colors, and 25 lip glosses, 6 blushes, 3 bronzers, two eye pencils, and one lip pencil. And it has four brushes slash applicator and one mirror. So you get a really good amount of stuff. Which I'm just going to throw that in the trash. There's just... And this is what it looks like. It still has the wrapping on it, but it's, it looks kind of like a little... This reminds me kind of like of the little tiny Sephora bags. Like, how it's just little tiny and it's black and it has the handles. Which I think is super cute. And let me get the plastic. There's like saran wrap that connects it all on it. Ugh. Like as you could tell by that, I hadn't opened this at all. Um, I'd only taken it out of the box. And the case all around it says wet and wild on both sides. And then on the sides it has like some lines. Also I'm really sorry about the lighting. It's really late. I spent all day out with my grandparents. Excuse me, I just, like, burped or something. Um, because my grandfather, they let him out for today on a trial basis, which was really fun. Alrighty. So, when you first open it, this is kind of the first section you see, all of these eyeshadows. It has a very good variety of, like, um, cool tones and warmer tones and matte and shimmers so that's really nice it has plastic over it which I can take off maybe <laughs> oh lord I just shook the camera too I'm sorry alrighty so you can see these kind of better I'm making sure it doesn't slide so there's all of those I like how it starts out with the lighter colors and goes to the darker ones I think that's really nice. And then, this is going to be so hard to show. Okay, so then it slides out to the lip glosses. Ah, this is a struggle, I swear. Okay, so it slides out to the lip glosses, which are right in the middle, which also has a good variety of kind of really shimmery ones and then the darker one. Ooh, I really like this, um, where is it on here? This plummy color right here. That's really pretty. Um, and it, again, goes from light to dark colors. Alright. And next. Ah. This is so cool. Alright, the sides, oh, that slides out. Okay. Oh, man, that's kind of disappointing. <laughs> That just really disappointed me right there. Um, 
Ah, uh, okay. These are the eye pencils and the lip pencils are here. And then these little ones down here are the blushes. Which kind of disappointed me. I figured I would get... Well, that worked out. Okay. I figured I would get a big selection of blushes. Like a bigger palette-wise. But that's okay. And the lip pencil... I don't know if I'd use it as actually a lip pencil. It's kind of like bronzy and you can't really see it but it's more of a bronzy color or like a dark brown it's really nice for like a nude lip though I'm really sorry about the lighting it's really dark outside already and I have no natural lighting in my room but yeah so that's that side and then the other side I really like how these close it just kind of it's kind of like a magnet. Here, I'll show you guys. So you have it open, and then it's just kind of... Like, it's really cool. Alright, you can quit opening and closing. But, on this section here, it has this part which... Ah, I'm ruining everything, I swear. Which had plastic on it, which I just took off. So you kind of open this area right here, and there is a mirror, which is a pretty big mirror. It's like a good size. And then it has, I said it had three bronzers, but I see two bronzers and a highlight. Um, so that's what they look like there. And then it has the little brushes. So those are really nice. Which I don't normally use these brushes, but sometimes I do if I really want to pack on the shadow. So now I think I'll do a couple swatches. Um, I really am interested in this plummy lip color right here. So maybe if I can get some, I'll do a swatch of it. I hate lipsticks like this because you can't really get swatches of them. I can't get a swatch of it. Alright, I think I'm going to test the three bronzer kind of shades. And then I'll do one matte eyeshadow and one shimmer eyeshadow of the light and one two of the dark. Um, so this is the highlighter. It's really pigmented. It's really nice. It's like right there on my hand. And then the one in the middle is kind of a bronzy shade, which you can't really see. And that's really pretty. I really like that one. You see it right there? It's really nice. And then the next shade. Oh, that's more of a peachy tone. That's really nice too. It's right here. Alright, now, should I do the blush? No, I'm not going to do the blush. Alrighty. Now, for the shadows. Oh, wait. I was like, why can't I close that? It's because I still have the mirror up. <laughs> okay. So, I'll do one matte light shimmer and one matte dark shimmer, and then one shimmery of each. So... Let's do this matte one right here for light, and this black one for dark. Ooh, this is the two shades that are matte. I did this shade right here, and this black one on the bottom. <coughs> now I'm dying. Okay, so I'll just do it on my wrist. Oh, that's really nice. The black is really, really pigmented. That's really nice. Okay. Alright, now for shimmery colors. Hmm. Do I want to do weird colors? I kind of want to see what that blue looks like. But that's a matte color. Hmm. Alright, I'm going to do this plummy one on the bottom for shimmer. And this one right here for the light, I think. Alright, so this is what they look like swatched, and then that's what they look like on my arm. Can you see it? Not really. Where's my other tablet? It's plugged in. Of course you are. I was going to use that as lightning. Okay, so the two I swatched that time 
was this plummy shade right down here and then this shimmery bronzy shade right here so yeah i just want to see what this blue looks like these two blue colors oh that's pretty so that's what two different blue colors look like that's kind of a aqua blue color and this is a like sky blue color which are both really pretty I don't wear blues that much though it's like magnetic I see that now I broke it I just broke a shade oh that's sad oh well kids don't play with your eyeshadow palette you'll break them but anyways now, do I think that was worth the price? Yes, I do. But the same... I think $30 is definitely worth the price um, for as much stuff as you get. I just wish that the blushes were bigger. Because um, I expected them to be bigger and not the size of like the little lip glosses. Um, so I guess I should read the back. It says, The set, a dazzling collection of makeup essentials created... Conveni conveniently in one place, featuring a stunning, ar a stunning array of bold, long-lasting, richly pigmented shades for the beauty rock star on the go. Palette features slide-out drawers, making it compact in size and easy to carry anywhere. I think that is true completely because this would be a really easy travel case because it's kind of all in together. The only thing I would need besides this is pretty much mascara, eyeliner, um, powder, like face powder, uh, blush, not blush, because there's blush in there, um, foundation, concealer, powder, eyeliner, something for my brows, and mascara, and if I was going to wear lipstick, if not, then I would have lip glosses that I could wear in here, and yeah, and then just brushes, so it's really good, I have a, can make a million different like makeup tutorials with this and different eyeshadow styles and stuff with this alone so I think it is worth the price um, I think $30 is really good for a $200 value uh, the only thing that I don't like is the size of the blushes pretty much um, but I think you get a really nice mirror with it you get the bronzers were gorgeous um, but I think the one bronz bronzer they should have said two bronzers and a highlight as well instead of three bronzers because the one you definitely couldn't use as a bronzer no matter how pale you are um but yeah the shadows themselves they're so pigmented and really really nice which wet and wild shadows are some of my favorites if you would like any tutorials using any of these shades in here that you saw or anything like that uh just let me know i'm thinking about doing a one brand tutorial which I know people don't really do those very much anymore, but I really want to try them. Um, and I want to use Wet n Wild, because I've never seen one brand tutorial used with Wet n Wild. So if you want to see that, please leave a like. And don't forget to subscribe. I upload every single day. And if there's any other videos you guys would like to see, you can comment those below. And all my links are below if you want to follow me on anything. And yeah. But besides that, I think that's it for today. I hope you all had a lovely day. I'm sorry this video was up so late. Um... I promise tomorrow's won't be as late. And yeah, I think that's it. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.